Hello, it's Melinda from Elixirs and Melinda's Art Space. Wow, this won't even fit in the camera frame. I got another parcel. I picked up two parcels at the post office today. They were both Happy Mail. Um, or one was a prize and one was mail. I love these. Is that napkin? I'm definitely going to have to take that off and use it. I've got high stuck on it. I'm su surprised that survived. And Santa and some stickers. So this is from Amanda Scott Burton. Um... We sort of, oh, I suppose you'd call it a swap. Um, I noticed she posted some Harry Potter things from one of her hauls, and I said to her, I've got her a few Harry Potter embellishments I will forward on her way. I was making Amanda Christina a bunch, and I made way too many. So I decided to gift them, and it's funny, it worked out to be both Amanda's. Wow. So I sent her, apparently there's stuff in here for Alexis. If there's stuff in here for Alexis, I will put it aside, and... Um, get Alexis to do a small video as well. What have you done, Amanda? Wow, that is so cute. I hope that one's mine, but I very much doubt it. Oh, maybe a beautiful card. Dear, Alexis, uh, dear Melinda Alexis, wishing you a very Merry Christmas and a fantastic New Year. I hope you enjoy your gifts. I'm sure I'll love them. I really enjoy seeing your YouTube videos. Love, Amanda. But it's such a cute card. Now, I struggle at cards. If I put that onto a card, it wouldn't look as nice for some reason. Because I really suck at cards. Oh, handmade 2018 cards. That is so cute. You drew... Did you draw that or is it a stamp? That is really cute. It's like a little fit. Well, where are we? It's a little fist. Now, I wonder which one. She said she put some stuff in for Alexis. I wonder if one's for me and one's for Alexis. Let's have a looky see. This is, oh, just, this is just gorgeous. I'm guessing this one might be for Alexis. Let's have a wee, wee peek inside. Ah, uh, I spied something. That one's Alexis's. So you're just going to have to wait a few minutes while I go through mine. And then, oh, what's down the bottom? But he's just, oh, he's gorgeous. I just want to sit here and play with him. Okay, I'll get Alexis to do a short video in a minute. This must be mine. I love how you presented them. Let me pull this out. I don't actually, that's <laughs> funny. Actually, I've never done a Lex, uh, Christmas stocking for Alexis. Um, I've always just done like a pile of, whoops, where are we? Um, always just done like Christmas stuff in a satchel or in a um, like a bag or something or all wrapped up presents we've never done really stockings I never had them as a kid oh you've made me a calendar this would be cute sitting on my desk so I never know what date it is this would be good to plan out my YouTube videos it's very cute the calendars just slightly come off but I can stick that back down and it looks like oh wow that's a clever idea it's a post-it note hole. What a clever idea. You know what? I may be stealing that idea. That is really, really cool. I love the little calendars too. They'll be good in junk journals when the year is done. I'm sure 2019 will zip by as did 2018. Oh, wow. Home decor. This is cute. I'm sure Alexis is going to pinch this and want to stick it up on the windows. Isn't he beautiful? He is beautiful. Pretty cut self adhesive sticker. I'm loving the stocking too. Maybe Alexis and I have to start. What am I feeling in here? Maybe I don't want to stick my hand in. Um, start a tradition of using these stockings every year. Oh wow! Oh, you sent me some of. The, oh, you sent me so much of the fabric. You sure you kept enough for yourself? This is something I eyed off in one of her hauls from her op shops. This. Oh wow! This is just stunning. It's got like. I thought when I looked on the picture they're rhinestones, but they're they're like rhinestones. Oh, wow, that is just gorgeous. I'm gonna have to make something special with that. They are they're like little clustery glittery rhinestones. But that you sent me so much. I hope you kept enough for yourself. That is just so beautiful. I eyed that in one of your op shop hauls that you posted on. Um, I'll link Amanda's channel below. I'm not sure whether she does a lot of YouTube videos. If I think it's the right Amanda, she's done a few in the past. Um, maybe. I can't 
can't remember. That's terrible. I can't remember, but that is just, oh, it just feels beautiful. Like, they're really raised. That is really, really cool. Looks actually like it was cut to make something, because there's like a loop, like the front of a dress or something. Oh, wow. Oh, thank you so much. That is so cool. I'm going to have to make something with that. I'm going to have to put that in the top of my to-do list. Do I stick my hand in the stocking again? Oh. Oh wow, book paper. I love book paper. I love collecting old books. I must stop buying them and start using them. Um, that is awesome. Some old... Oh, I remember. This brings back memories. This was from a little book or something. I remember seeing these when I was a kid. They're recipes for the week and then you have the recipe, the shopping list for the entire week of recipes at the end. That is cool. I remember those as a kid or a young teenager. A menu planner. Ooh, chocolate mousse. Oh, another food I can't eat. Pancake mix? Oh, chocolate pancakes. Oh, I was looking at <laughs> I thought chocolate mousse recipe, I turned it over assuming the recipe's on the back and it's not. And I said chocolate, the pancake mix, and I'm thinking that's for that recipe. Oh, they're cool. I'm going to have to make a junk journal. And we've got, see, that's about the food I'm on at the moment. Rabbit food. Silly doctor. I don't know. Doctors take all your joy out of things, don't they? They probably do it for a good reason. But <laughs> And some, these look really old too because the typewriter, like the typewriter font is really really old what are these plum pudding in a cloth now I remember making plum puddings with um, my family at Christmas I always used to mix it till the suet went in and then I refused to touch the disgusting mixture and I never ate it there's a bit about my family Christmas so I used to sit there and I used to love to cook I love to cook Christmas things not cooking so many this year because Alexis won't eat a lot of it and I'm not allowed to eat it so I probably won't do a lot of the traditional cooking um, but yeah, I used to make the pudding, um, we never used to do it as in a cloth, we used to do it in a metal tin. And I used to always help until that yucky suet went in, and then I decided I didn't want to help anymore. The, the trans muscle, is this like medical? Ah, oh, it's medical stuff. Oh, cool. I've not got any old medical books, I'm on the lookout for some actually. Um, twice a year we have a big book sale oh wow um twice a year we have a big book sale in uh, my town and they do stuff by theme so each year i go in with an idea of what i want to pick up and usually pick up a whole lot more these are awesome these would be awesome in a halloween album oh wow and it's so old too i love the little pictures i love like geeky stuff not geeky stuff like this spooky stuff like this this is really cool oh there's a picture of a kidney the stomach, sorry, this obviously fail biology, that's a stomach, not a kidney, because it says words right there. Oh, this is really cool. Oh, what's this? Is that the spine? What the hell is that? Transverse section of the grey substance of the spinal cord. Okay. These are awesome. Thank you for sharing. Oh, I love the legs. Oh, check out the legs. you got to look at the legs. <laughs> These cool. I could, I so want to make that sort of album now. Oh, what's this? Is that rude? Can I show it? Well, that doesn't tell me what it is. Vertical section of temporomandibular articula uh, articulation. What the hell is that? No idea. I was hoping it wasn't, I wasn't wanting to show my body parts. They are awesome. I'm going to start collecting for that sort of journal now. And some wallpaper. Oh, awesome. I love collecting wallpaper. I've managed to get a couple of rolls from op shops recently, but gee, they like to stick prices on them. Whoops. Don't really want to rip that. Op shops have put their prices up. I think they're cottoned on to us crafters now. But I do have a couple of favourite ones that still, oh, that's pretty. Still do um, reasonably price. Thank you, Amanda. Oh, I especially love those book pages. I don't have anything like that yet. I'm actually going to start um, 
I want to start making some junk journals for myself and um, some friends and I want to start collecting things by theme. I know I want to help Alexis make a rabbit one and I want to make a peacock one. Now I want to make one. Oh, what's this? Square package. Um, oh, cute. The little photo frames. Um, so I'm going to get a series of pizza boxes, obviously not used, so I can um, start putting my stuff like that in the boxes so I don't lose it. Because at the moment, I possibly have stuff for a peacock album. I know I've got some peacock stuff somewhere, but do you know where? No. So next year, my word, well, my word for next year is organised. We'll see how long that lasts. Oh, wow, these are like look like they're made from polymer clay. They're cute. I can put a picture of Alexis on the tree. And Alexis... I could put a picture of me, but I really don't like pictures of me. So two pictures of Alexis. They are really cute. They would look awesome on the front of a journal as well. Hmm. Why does everything just make me want to make journals lately? So I will leave it there. I will get Miss Alexis to come and undo her stocking. Thank you so much, Amanda. These are awesome. I love the book pages and I love the fabric. I like anything that's weird and wonderful. Like these sort of drawings and things. These are just and the legs and the veins they are just awesome and that book looks so old it obviously was a very good find at the op shop and I love foreign book text I love things that are just different because I'm just different I don't like I don't like a lot of the vintage the flowery fluffy not fluffy flowery dainty shabby chic I'm more I oh know weird like that okay so Alexis will come back and open her stocking and, and this is just gorgeous. And Amanda, I think we're going to start a stocking tradition. We're going to keep these stockings and we'll put them out every Christmas. I'll put them into my Christmas box. Because as I said, we haven't got stockings. That's really cool. And I love this one. <gasps> Can I keep this one? Do you think Alexis would know? She's not here at the moment. I better not. I will give it to her. I'll be good. I'll be grown up and have my good grown up stocking. I won't sit here and play with the Rudolph after I put the camera off. Okay, next bit you'll see Alexis opening her little package. Ooh, what she got down there? <gasps> Can I peek? I won't. I promise. I'll be good. Thanks so much, Amanda, for my goodies. And I'll get Alexis to um, do a little film with her opening them. Bye. So I've got Alexis here to. What are you doing, Alexis? You're playing with your skate. I don't just stick your hand in there. There's nothing in there that will bite you and grab something out. So this is a look. This is a present from Amanda. What did you get? Oh, some mermaid stickers. Oh, they're cute. I haven't seen those ones yet, Amanda. They're really cool. They might swim in Mummy's pile. Oh, you got extras. See, Mummy can share. Oh, no, they're different. Fairy stickers. Oh, rainbow stickers. I like her bunny book. What is the? We got a golden book called the Bunny Book. Whoops. And some more stickers, some unicorn. No way, I'm cutting it up. A flying cat unicorn. Okay. No oh, way, look. I'm cutting that off. Unicorn ice cream. Oh, cute. I got one of these too. I got a Santa. We might put them up on the windows. What, the what? Hell is this supposed to be? I have no idea. Open it and find out. I'm just going to read Amanda's note very quickly. Ow. Maybe. Oh, she said perhaps one day you might make the book into a journal. You no, know what? We... What was that? Oh, we had an accident. Oh, I might be able to glue it. I'll be able to glue it. See, see, look, wouldn't know anything happened to it. Little egg cups with rabbits on them. Oh, they're so cute, Amanda. What do you say, Alexis? Thank you. I like the bunny book. It's even got a bunny toy. People are taking these apart and turning them into junk journals. Oh, look at all the rabbits. What do you say? Thank you. Thank you. Alexis is not feeling very well today, so she's a bit quiet. She's not feeling her usual self. Oh, they're so cute. I'll have to read you a bedtime story, Alexis. Yeah, I'll glue that back together. Just be very careful with it. You won't know any of the difference. Yeah. Well, 
I can will, see the difference. I will get some paint. They're cute, the little egg cups. Do you know you put a hard boiled egg in those and it sits up? I don't need it. I know you don't need eggs. You don't need a lot of things, child. Hopefully we'll grow out of it one day. Thank you so much, Amanda. They are very cute. And I'm sure one day Alexis will make it into a junk journal and then we'll show no. you. No. Unless it might be my all the funny pages. Yeah, well what you do is you take the book apart and you add a spine to it and you add other pages into it so you can write in it as well. And you I'm keep taking all the pages out though. Yeah, you keep all the pages out, you put them back in the journal and then you have like uh -huh. blank No? What do you want to do with the pages? Put different pages in there, but these pages take out. And do what I'll with? Put back in. And do what with? Oh, another cover for a book. I'm sure Alexis will figure out what she wants to do with that. I love the stickers. They are very cool. Thank you so much, Amanda. We love all our goodies. And I've given up. Oh, she's trying to eat. She's trying to break chocolate, the Kit Kat bar that's been in the fridge. We're trying to break it in half in your fingers, and it's not quite working. Thank you. Bye.